This episode is going to save you tons of time detecting the bearish engulfing candlestick chart pattern. Can't wait for you to check it out. The bearish engulfing candlestick chart pattern is used by many traders to identify a change in the market's momentum or direction. I've built this for a number of traders that I work with and it's really popular but it took me hours the first time that I did it. I wanted to create a video that will only take you three minutes that shows you exactly how to do it. No need to worry about getting into the details. So let's get into it. There's a few things that you need in order to complete this episode. First, you really need to have a MetaTrader 5 Expert Advisor up and ready to go with your init, dnet and on tech functions. That will just help you do this episode faster. And secondly, you really need to have a working MetaTrader 5 terminal, which will just help you test what you're building. Let's get into the code. You can see here that I've started by adding in all of the basic functions that an Expert Advisor needs to work. We've got our on init, on dnet, and on tick functions all ready to go. Now we're going to be adding in our bearish engulfing candlestick pattern detector. We'll start by declaring and commenting our function here, and we want it to return a boolean, which means a true or a false. It'll be true if it detects a bearish engulfing candlestick pattern and false otherwise. You can see here that my awesome AI powered dev environment, which is using VS Code plugged into MetaTrader 5, is suggesting me pretty much the whole function, but I'll do it slowly. By the way, if you ever want to see how to do that, uh, check out my episode on building your own AI powered dev environment using MetaTrader 5. It's pretty helpful and will definitely save you a ton of time when you're building your trading bots. However, for now, we'll keep doing this. So we'll be passing this function the values of the last two opens and the last two closes. And the reason we'll be doing it this way is because in the next episode, I'll actually show you how to detect a turnaround in the market, so we can detect a moment. Sorry, not a um, we can detect um, a series of bullish candles leading to the engulfing candle that will allow us to see if the direction is changing. We'll start in this function by checking to make sure that the last candle is bullish and if it is return false. So if the last close is greater than or equal to the last open we're going to return false. Then we want to check that the second to last candle is actually bullish. And we do that by checking if it's bearish. Hopefully that made sense to you. If it is bearish then we just return false again. Now we want to make sure that we've got an engulfing uh, candle happen. So we do that by comparing to make sure that the last open is greater than the second to last close and the last close is less than the second to last open. In theory, we could actually just exit there and say, well, that's met the technical definition of an engulfing candle. However, many of the traders that I've built trading bots for actually prefer to have a way of detecting the size or the relative size of that engulfing. They might say something like, only return true if it's 50% larger than the previous candle. So we're going to add in a multiplier that allows us to do that. We do that by comparing the value of the last candle, the body of it I should say, add in 1.5 and we multiply that with the body of the second one and only then do we return true. Now once again we could probably say that this function is complete. But you might be looking at that 1.5 and saying, well, actually, I prefer if it was like 60 or 70%. Rather than try and just modify these values each time, what we can do is add in an input parameter up the top that says candlestick multiplier set to a default of whatever you want. I'm going to make it 1.5 and only then do we use it. So we can change this 1.5 to be the candlestick multiplier, candle size multiplier there. That's pretty cool. So there's our bearish engulfing detector. To see it in action, just to prove that it works, we can put it in here. So we want to get our candlestick data. Here we're using the eye open and eye close functionality that comes with MetaTrader. And we'll check if a bearish engulfing candlestick pattern has occurred. Perfect. Compile that. Whoops. One other thing we need to do here uh, is we need to have a default return condition of false. Pilot. No issues, no warnings. 
Uh, my market over here is currently closed in Australia, but you could go and add that now to your MetaTrader 5 by doing this. Refresh that. Is our bearish engulfing candle detector. Yes, we want to attach that. And you can see here we've got our bearish engulfing multiplier. And away we go. Like I said, my market's closed, so it won't be detecting anything right now. In the next episode then, like I said, I'll actually be showing you how to take this and turn it into a market trend change detector. I'll see you there.